custom shapes in Photoshop can be modified, transformed, distorted, whatever. I'm just going to quickly show you how to transform the design to create a slightly different shape from an original shape. So I'm just going to select the custom shape tool and then go to the shape palette and you'll see a selection of shapes here. They're from the custom shapes collection from graphicextras.com. Just going to select one of these. Now, if you apply the shape in the fill layer, fill design, you, you're actually not getting a layer, you can't transform that. But if you select the path or the shape layer, and I'm just going to select the shape layer, that's probably the easiest demonstration. So just apply the shape like that. And now it applies it in red because that's the current color there. Now you can go to the edit, transform path, scale, rotate, skew, perspective, all those sort of things. Also, you can use the free transform path. Now, I always find it probably easy just to use the free transform path. So just select that. Now you can resize the shape. So you can rotate the shape. You can also, by holding down the control key, you can actually skew the shape. So I'm just going to quickly do that. So just create a slightly different shape design from the original now hold down a combination of control and shift you can apply perspective to the design so I'm just going to quickly stretch it out that way so you can actually create a modify the shape like that. now at that point you can actually if you wish you can actually go to the edit define custom shape you can actually shape, save that shape as a new shape. So I click OK. So you now can use that future designs. Of course, you can undo that. I'm just going to undo do that. Also, I can show you quickly the edit, transform path, and warp. Now, that probably creates a, a more drastic design change. So there's various options come up. Custom. So there's arc. So you can distort the thing there. Can also modify the distortion using the control point bulge change that you can of course modify the value at the top here changing the various horizontal vertical different options there's many options here squeeze it's another one so bend squeeze that really tight extreme Click OK, and now you've got a slightly different altered shape. Now you can also alter the shape in other ways, but that's uh, using the transform tool. So it's the. So just quickly get rid of that. I'm just going to quickly show, show you another shape. Again, just edit, transform path, perspective warp. But again, free transform path is quite useful, but transform path, just warp. And you can actually warp the design directly so just modify the shape create, distort that out create some really unusual shapes click OK and then define the custom shape and you've got a new custom shape from that which you can then apply I'm just going to quickly show you the custom shape it's in the palette there just put it there change the colour and just quickly show you can just quickly apply the custom shape like that.